All right, guys, so now we're going to do upload objects. So I just commented this out and I called it download objects and just copied the same thing. And we're going to just modify this for upload objects. So first thing, let's go to Google. That's I always use Google. Google. So photo three, how to upload objects. Pretty sure it's very similar. So we don't want to use this put. We just, I'm looking for something that instead of download, it says upload. So look, that is very simple, very similar to what we just did. So let's copy that. Actually, we don't even need to copy it. All we need to do is change this line to upload. So upload, wait, what was it called? Upload file, makes sense. Upload file. And let me paste, let's use this for reference. So upload file, so local file goes first and then where you wanna put it. So um, we actually don't wanna loop through this bucket anymore. So let's actually get rid of all of this. What we want to do is we want to loop through like a folder in our um, file system, right? So I have a bunch of pictures. Where is it? Drone images. So here we go. So no, I'm trying to find ones that just have JPEGs. No. That's fine. Actually, I don't, I'm trying to find, I don't want to upload MP4s because they're going to take longer. Here we go. So let's just loop through this file on our computer and upload them to S3. So let's just make a new variable called uh, local upload directory. Spelled directory wrong, directory equals that so just find a folder where you have images or whatever you want to upload and now we just need to like loop through that location so four images in local upload directory let's google python list objects in folder so this is what we want to do os.lister so let's try four images in os.lister we're going to give it our local directory let's just see what this is giving us so let's just print images and again this is nothing really specific to boto 3 here this is just listing, we're just listing some objects. So let's try that. All right, so it's giving us just the, the file name. So we don't want that, we want the full path to the file name. Because if we gave this to Boto3, it wouldn't know where to find this and it wouldn't work. So we need to use that os.path.join again to join this with this so we want to join that with with the slash and that so if we say os.path.join local upload directory and then images well, actually it's called image because it's just one image image so let's say full upload path and let's just make sure this looks right. So print full upload path. It's not, oh yeah, we gotta get rid of this. Okay, there we go. So that looks like a legit location that we can give Bodo. And yeah, it's gonna try to, to upload it. So now we should be able to uncomment that. 
And what do we want to upload? We want to upload. That's what we just did. We, we built that path, full upload path. And now this is just saying folder to sub path to S3 key. So this is just what you want to name your object, basically. So we want to name this. Uh, so this is like where you want to put it in S3. So we want to put it, let's make a new folder actually called um, examples or something. So YouTube examples slash and now we actually now we do want to just use this. So remember how we um, we join that, but we don't want to join it. We just want to use it right here. So let me put an F in front of here and we just want to put image right there. So this is, you know, this is the path on S3 where it's going to reside. And since we're connecting to a, a particular bucket here, we don't need to tell it what bucket to go to. It's, it's assuming it's going to be in this bucket and then it's where in that bucket and it's going to be in this location. So let's just try that and say print uploading to blank and we're going to say uploading um, full upload path to let's just copy this line here. Well, to, yeah, hold on, YouTube examples slash image, and then we'll say print done uploading, let's copy all that, put an F in front of it. And then let's add a slash in. Let's get rid of this. Okay. Seven minutes in the video, we are ready to try uploading it to the bucket. So let's try this. So uploading, oh, that was fast. So uploading that, so uploading this. So let's go to S3 and make sure we actually see these up. So there should be a new YouTube underscore Tutorial, where is it? Oh, see, we're in the Lambda GDAW, so we need to back out. Refresh here. Here we go, YouTube examples. And there we go, We are, it's actually uploading fast. So yeah, that that's how you upload um, stuff to S3 with Boto3. Pretty, pretty straightforward, pretty simple, pretty easy to work with. Uh, so yeah, if you have any questions, uh, just leave some comments. And if you like these, these videos, just please like and subscribe. Uh, and thanks for watching.